so in civil 3d you can able to create the manual point for one time so next time if you want many points you can just click one point you put control c for copying that point and then control v see now it is asking insert insertion point so you can put some point so now it is asking duplicate point number resolution you can use next point number or you can use any one of these resolution methods so i will go for use next point number so i will just click okay then we can able to have a new point with the new northing and easting so all these points having elevation similar okay so if you want to change the northing easting and elevation so how you can change so you have here right see for example this point so this point so when you keep your cursor on top of it so when you hover your mouse on top of some points you can able to see the number and everything apart from that you can also see easting northing elevation and everything okay otherwise here we have all the numbers with point number easting northing elevation descriptions and everything okay so apart from that you can just uh, double click it when you double click you will get the properties window and here also you have so here you can able to change for example if i want to change the elevation you can just uh, change here see now you can able to see the new elevation again if i am just uh, clicking here this is Kogo point 5 so you can just go to 5 here so here you can able to change the elevation so like this we can able to like create points and then change the easting northing and elevations or you can also go for control 1 click and control 1 for property so apart from that you also have something here click here after the green window it will appear and here in modify section so edit list or points then here also you can able to change so you need to tick it so all this method you can able to like uh, modify the northing easting and elevations